One of the biggest life lessons for me was learning to trust God for finances. The first year that Gary and I were married, I cried through a lot of the year <laughs> because che checks came in short, paychecks came in short, and we just didn't have enough money, and I didn't know what we were gonna do. The second year, um, I cried less. And the third year, I didn't cry much at all because I had begun to realize that God would supply all my needs according to His riches in Christ Jesus, not my riches. <laughs> I remember a time when we came back from a, uh, a trip. We were traveling around to different campuses, and we really didn't have much in the house to eat at all. We were down to just about nothing in food, so we were praying over this, and as we were praying, the doorbell rang, and Gary went to the door, and it was a student, a high school student, that he had hap happened to run into and started discipling. And here he stood with a bag of, of dressed quail in his hand. He says, I wanted to give you this. And as he did that, um, you know, I just was there listening, and I thought, oh, God, you came through again. <laughs> and we were so thankful. And a few years after that, we were needing a new car. So we started praying about it. And some very close friends called us up and they said, do you need a car? And Gary said, um, well, yeah, we do. And we hadn't been in real close contact, so they didn't know. We were needing another, a new car. And he said, well, I've got one for you. It was a Cadillac Eldorado convertible. <laughs> and it was, um, you know, we almost thought, do we dare take this? <laughs> and we felt that we had followed what he wanted and he had, you know, really blessed us. As a result, um, we, from that day, have never had another car payment. One of the guys Gary was working with, out of the blue, gave us a Trans Am. <laughs> And we thought, oh my goodness. <laughs> it was a neat testimony for our neighbors because we were able to share with them and just, you know, share how God is a, our provider and the people at our church, you know, because um, they'd say, oh, that's a nice car <laughs> for a missionary. <laughs> and so we'd be able to share how faithful God is in our lives.